So let's see now an example. This example is called the vending machine. Uh, we already uh, see this example. We will learn the time it automated. And there we learn how we uh, examine the time of the time automator. We, we call it there is uh, time automator execution. So here, the same example. In this example, we have three locations. The first is waiting, adding sugar, delivering the coffee. So here we see before how the time is run. And we see here starting with both of them is zero. And then if we add without sugar, we see the execution without sugar. So just zero. And then since we have here conditions, so we will not rise to the top until we the time is reached to five. Until if we are in that's when we are five. If we are in the adding delivering the copy, the time is five. We will not press this transition until the time is equals eight and then the time is five. So this is without sugar and we have another one with sugar and we study the execution of both. So let's now implement them on open. So here, these two, actually we have here one time automator. We have time automator, only one time automator, but here we have to develop two time automators. The first one is the time automator and the second one is the user. Since here we have start, so who start? The user start and then Copy, deliver the copy, the cup, deliver the cup to the user, deliver the copy to the user, and the user start the machine. So we have two time automata. The first one is the machine, the second one is the user, and we have uh, three, four actually, we have four channel start, sugar to add sugar, cup to deliver the cup, and then in the end, the copy is ready, so deliver the copy and go again to the waiting of the item. Here the same, uh, the same channels, and here we have the waiting, adding sugar, delivering, while here the start, the user will start, the user will add sugar, same name, and then the user will receive the copy. So three state here, three state here. So let's see how we can simulate this. The simulation here shows that this example or this copy example with out sugar and also here with, with two spoon of sugar. So let's go to the Google. Let's go to Google. Let's go to the Google and check these simulators so we open our model our model is machine machine two. so here the model uh, in this model we have two machine two parameter and for so in the simulator, so let's see the simulator. We have two machine or two processors, this machine and user. And we see now without sugar. Without, without sugar, also we see the time. See here, we start, the user will start and sync, synchronize to another machine. So here, if we want to add sugar, we can take this. If we don't want to, just we can go. I mean, now we are in adding sugar, but we will not take sugar. The, uh, this we have two options here. Maybe we take sugar or we just deliver the cup. So we want to deliver the cup, deliver the cup, and then after that, we go back to, we go back to our, to the state, to the system. So we see here X is. Both of them should be same since no effect because here we 
uh, receipt the uh, y receipt x but here yeah, just we go since we go without distance so both and then x and y is eight so we back to the previous and now we can go to the second set so this is without sugar as we see we not take this shallow or this transition so now we receive and then we go again next okay scroll so now we are we move we move from the first we receive now we go okay we are in the first state move to the other state we move okay scroll we move so here if you want to add sugar, we take that one. So if you do want to take this one, so we want to add sugar. So we add sugar, one sugar. So this is one sugar is added. We add another one more sugar. As you see the time here, once you add that uh, sugar, the value of X received. Every time the value of X is received, but Y, Y will not be received. This is you see. 2 to 5, but here from 1 to 4. Now, if you add sugar, the same thing, the value of y will increase. We add one more sugar. So, that x not increase since x is reset. So, it's reset and we come again to 0 and should be less than 5. Since we are here, still less than 5. So, this is we add 2 sugar and then we have now x, the value of x between 3 and 5. So if you want to pass this, the value should be 5. So we can take this one. So now the value is 5. So go to the next. So now should be the value is 8. Now after this next the value here will disappear, but now you see here. The value of y is 8, value of x will be 3 and 6. So we have only one transaction. So here more than 8 and here more than or equal. So let's back to our slides and we see our transition or execution. As we see is same. Here we say uh, the x will be, uh, as they say, from 3 to 6. But y is equal to 8. So similar to the execution or similar to the time in Google. 